Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Hanky. Uh, I'm new to this whole Call of Duty thing. Uh, it's an amazing game, and I, I thank Machinima Respawn for giving me the chance to showcase my abilities and uh, showcase myself on this channel because uh, there's a lot of there's a lot of good players here on this channel, and uh, I like to consider myself among the, the among the top players. So it's really good to finally have my place. Uh, my rightful place among my peers. It, uh, Call of Duty, I, I just recently got into it actually. I, I, I've been a, a fan of Call of Duty for a really long time, but uh, I've never really gotten a chance to play it. You know, usually uh, when, I would, when I would watch Call of Duty, I'd usually go into Walmart and I'd usually uh, test play it on those, on those test TVs that they have uh, hanging out in the game section. Uh, usually I'd spend like maybe three or four hours a day in Walmart playing Call of Duty on those test TVs. Uh, it was such an amazing experience to me. Uh, when the Walmart employee would come over to me, they'd tell me to get out. I'd, I'd, you know, I'd tell them straight up that uh, you know, they can't treat me like this and I, I want to continue playing Call of Duty. Uh, so I would continue to do so and uh, I, I would end up not buying the game because obviously I, I'm, not, I'm not that rich. Uh, so I, I can't I can't go and buy everything that I want. So uh, I had to save up for a long time. I saved up for actually about three years so I can get the sixty dollars to buy the game. Uh, so in doing so, now I I, I feel like uh, I I finally got my rifle my rifle game here in my console, and I don't think I'll ever take it out of my console because it's such an amazing game. Uh, I love everything about the game, right down to the exploits. Uh, I, I love the exploits. I mean, you know what they say about exploits. Uh, same thing they say about people with big feet. Uh, they, they wear big socks. And uh, if, they, if they wear big socks, someone's obviously going to have to fill in those socks. And uh, to be honest with you guys, I think I'm the man for that job. I think I'm the man that can fill the socks. I think I'm the man that can fill Machinima Respawn socks. Uh, and if you guys let me, I think I could fill your socks. Uh, I don't mean that in any kind of homosexual way or manner. I just, you know, want to fill somebody's socks. Uh, so Call of Duty. Call of Duty, uh, like I said before, I'm pretty pretty good at this game. Uh, over the course of playing it in Walmart, I have gone pretty much from an amateur to an elitist within a few hours of playing in, in the store. Uh, I consider myself to be a pretty big deal. When, uh, when I actually got the game in my hands, I just, you know, it, within day one, I was already past the, uh, the first prestige. Uh, you know, I've ran the ropes before, I know what I'm doing, I know the spots, I know the call-outs, uh, I know all the terminology, and I know the passion that it takes in order to be uh, a solid and successful Call of Duty player, and commentator, for that matter. Uh, a lot of the Call of Duty community has either uh, lost that passion, or quite frankly, they, they never had it to begin with. And, uh, just to give you guys a little bit of background information on myself, because obviously, like I said, I am new to this whole Call of Duty thing. Uh, I, I love to hunt. I love hunting. A uh, cool story that I usually give um, uh, every time I usually meet somebody new. Uh, a few years back, actually, I, I awoke one day just, you know, from normally sleeping in my bed. Uh, I awoke from my slumber and I, I had a, a disease. It's a disease, what they call fat leg disease. Uh, there's, there's a very scientific name for it. I, I can't really think of it offhand, but uh, I believe it's called a good oscus. Uh, so I, uh, when I awoke in, I, I had this disease, and uh, it's a condition where the glands in your leg, uh, basically the complete portion of your leg, your entire leg, completely swell up to the point of no return. Uh, so basically, uh, it's it's what's called nicknamed fat leg. And it's okay though. There's there's no need to worry about me or anything like that. I have tons of people asking me about it today. Uh, I was told by the doctor that it actually helped prevent heart disease. So it's all good. Uh, I do occasionally uh, have a person that calls me names and hateful things because it's not every day that you see a person walking down the street with uh, one really, really big leg, one really, really fat leg, and, and a somewhat smaller leg. Uh, usually what I do is if, if I hear somebody say something out loud about my leg, I usually sit the person down, uh, whether it be on a park bench or uh, you know wherever the case may be, I'll, I'll sit them down and I will uh, take off my glasses and I'll tell the story about this time I went hunting. Uh, the reason I love Call of Duty so much is the guns. And I know that the, the game has the ACR. 
which is actually code name for the uh, automatic slight cologne resecutator. Uh, and my daddy actually got me one of those. And uh, this one day we went hunting. Uh, we actually came face to face with a bear. It was a huge bear, a uh, really big bear. So the bear, me, and my daddy, we, we got into a scuffle. And the bear ended up knocking my automatic cyclone resecutator out of my hands. And he, he also knocked my dad's titanium bolt shotgun out of his hands. So uh, it, it was really quite the predicament. And I really had no choice but to either let my father die or... I had to take this bear on, I had to be a man, I had to stand up to this bear, I had to show him who's boss, I had to take the bear on in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Uh, now I can't move around too much with my leg, my, with my fat leg, uh, but during this fight I, I issued the challenge to the bear, the bear proceeded to charge me, and I, I, uh, I brought up the courage within me to, to use my fat leg to my advantage. And basically what I did was I did a jumping Hayamato leg lariat to the bear. Uh, a leg lariat to the bear in which I, I hit the side of the bear's face with the middle of my knee. Now, it, obviously, the, 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 the bone from my knee could not hit the bear because there's a lot of fat surrounding my leg. Uh, but because the fat in my leg is, is packed so tightly and my, uh, my glands are swelled up so, so much, uh, the force was just as deadly, and I, I killed the bear instantly. Uh, it was crazy. It was a crazy situation, to say the least. Uh, so, so if anybody ever asks me or, or makes fun of my, my fat leg, I usually bring that up to them and then they usually say, you know what, that, that's, that's pretty impressive and uh, I commend you for that and that you are, you're a courageous guy for, for doing that for your father. And I said, thank you, thank you very much. And uh, so that's pretty much why I'm so drawn to Call of Duty. And uh, that's pretty much my story. And uh, I, I'm glad that you guys actually, you know, sat through and listened to my story. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to do more commentaries in the future. More Call of Duty commentaries in the future. Uh, so with that said, I uh, will talk to you guys later. Be sure to follow us on Twitter. There you'll find the latest updates from our premier directors and the Machinima Respawn team.